Hello everyone, it's Dawn here from Dawn's Inspirations. Just want to share another quick top tip with you today. Um, today I'm going to make a quick embellishment for my scrapbook page. This is a little paper clip banner embellishment that I'm going to make with you. Easily made out of some scraps of paper and some elements that match the paper stock that you can use on your scrapbook layouts or a card. So all you need to do is to get a paper clip from a stationery's shop. This is the bigger than your everyday paper clip so you can get whatever size you, you wish you feel comfortable with and a scrap of paper and then I've got a little element to pop on the top I'm going to cut this down a little bit because it's just a little bit too big it's a little bit too long as well but I'm not too concerned with that at the moment I'm now going to fold this in half I'm going to have the spotty side showing for me then where I fold it in half I'm just going to pinch it in the middle just tease it in this is quite a thick cardstock this one's a basil uh, no, basic grey cardstock and um, paper stock actually but it's more like cardstock so this is basic grey but this works with any of your um, pattern papers you can always do it with cardstock as well that's not not a problem but what you have to do is the thicker it is just keep working I'm manipulating it like I'm doing now and it just uh, lets the paper find another line and it just sort of takes the stiffness out of the paper now when it's starting to look at that stage you can see that there looks a bit like a bow we're then going to thread our paper clip we're going to use the single hooped end so that's going to go through there we're going to twist the cardstock so it folds over on itself Fold that in on both sides. Bring that together. I'm quite happy with that. Bring that piece out a little bit more. It's not quite matching. There we go. So that's now looking like that. So now we're going to put some glue in. I'm just going to use some Kalal All Purpose glue for this project. But you can use any PVA, Cosmic Shimmer, Glossy Accent, whatever you feel comfortable with. Put a bob of glue down the middle there as well because that will help secure the paper clip. And then push that together. Double sided tape doesn't work so well on this. Um, I find the glue is better because you've got some wiggle room and you can also get some glue down this end where you want it to hold. Okay. So that's what that's looking like now. Now that's quite large. I don't really want my... Um, tab that that long so I'm going to trim off a little bit here now I'm going to edge mine now with a pro marker just to give it a finished edge I'm going a little bit thicker line that's why I'm going over it a couple of times I'm not going to do any down that side. I'm going to do back and front because remember these embellishments are two-sided. So if you wanted to use them to hold elements down on your page. And then to finish this one off, I've got a little button the same colour with some twine through it that I'm going to stick on there. So I'm going to use some glossy accents for this. So blob of glossy accents. Pop my button on goes quite nicely with the dots as well and there's my my uh, embellishment so quick simple embellishment that you can make to go on a scrapbook layout and a page so very quick to do nice and 3d give a different dimension to your to your work so there you go so that's one of my top tips to make a quick embellishment out of a paper clip and scraps of paper hope you enjoyed it bye bye